Stand up. Put your hands behind your back. Someone got rubber gloves. She's covering blood. Did you eat that cat? Did you eat it? No, why'd you f*** it? Alright, so look now. Quick video here. Now, unfortunately, I didn't get to watch the presidential debate last night. Former President Donald Trump versus Vice President uh, Kamala Harris. Now, don't misconstrue that. Although I'm not too deep into politics, I do watch debates. I do plan on uh, voting. For the last two elections, I've been old enough to uh, vote. And I did so on the presidential side as well as inner city elections, right? Because all of that matters. It's not just about Trump and Harris. But what happened last night, hey man, I was asleep. It is what it is, right? I was tired, man. Y'all stalled me out. But when I woke up, I noticed a lot of people uh, saying, uh, well, first of all, they was talking about Trump because he was uh, speaking of immigrants eating cats. Like he went on a, a rant talking about how immigrants are eating animals. And then the internet is basically saying he's making up stuff. He just went on a rant talking about nothing. And you know what? I would think so myself. Like that sounds crazy, right? Immigrants eating cats? Like what they gotta do with the presidential election, fam? And how do you know about immigrants eating cats? Like what the hell is going on? If that was the case, it'd be worldwide news right now. It gotta be cap. But unfortunately, I can't call cap because I actually made a video about a Haitian lady eating a cat just about a week or two ago. Like fam, there's an entire video out there. The cop arrived on the scene. You can see all of his uh his video footage. The lady is literally sitting on the ground, like she's outside sitting on the ground, eating a cat. She ripped off the cat's head, started eating the cat's head. No seasoning salt, no hot sauce, no nothing, fool. Eating a raw cat head. And everybody's just standing around her in disbelief. Like, they just staring at her. Nobody ain't trying to take the cat from her. Nobody not doing anything at all. I mean, they called the police. That was good enough, right? But dang, they just standing right there staring at her eating the cat. Like they want some or something. Dang, what y'all want a plate too? Sitting there watching a the lady eat a cat. A little big and silly. But nah, in all seriousness, I probably would have did the same thing. I would have been in shock, man. This lady just ripped off a cat's head in front of my face, and now she's biting into the cat's head. Like, this doesn't suppose to happen. And then Trump ain't even uh speak about the other thing she ate. She also ate a spider, fam. Like, I'm not making this up. Go check it out for yourself. She ate a spider, folk. The NCBC spider went up the water spout. Down came the rain. And, ah, shut up. I'm hungry. Ain't nobody trying to hear that. She just ate the spider, folk. Eating spiders. Eating cats. I'm not trying to defend Trump or anything, but this dude wasn't lying. Now, I will say this. At first... I didn't know she was an immigrant. I thought she was just like a, a regular black woman or something. A regular black American woman. But now looking more into it, yeah, she's a Haitian immigrant that just recently came here. She out there in Ohio eating cats, fool. She just can't go to the Chinese plate. What's wrong with sesame chicken, man? It's the same thing. No disrespect to the Chinese people, right? Shout out to the Chinese people. Shout out to the Chinese place. Boy, that sesame chicken be good as hell. But word around town, boy, it might be some cat, and it might be some dogs in there. We don't know. Cat dog, cat dog, on the world with a little cat dog. Like, dang, you dead hungry? You couldn't just go to the Chinese place? Police pull up on her, blood all over her mouth. This lady look like Resident Evil, fool. I see why them people ain't trying to take that cat from her now. Boy, she probably would have tried to bite them. Uh, 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 little Resident Evil zombie. 
But yeah, Trump won't lie about that. Now, I got to watch the debate and get caught up on everything. But from that viral clip right there, I can tell you, that dude ain't lying. Well, they out here eating cats, y'all. Y'all better run. Uh-oh. Everybody better run. Everybody better run. The cat woman out here, y'all. Hide your key. Hide your pets. Well, it ain't no telling what she gonna eat next. Where was she from again? Like, where did this happen? Ohio. Man, y'all got the T-virus out there. That lady out there giving out the cooties. She done brought back the cooties. Well, that ain't Ohio. That's Raccoon City. Out there eating cats. Y'all go watch the video for yourselves, though. Trump probably lied about a lot of stuff. But boy, that dude telling the truth right there. Seen it with my own eyes. Lady sitting there eating the cat. An entire audience watching her. It was crazy, man. I just didn't know she was an immigrant until now. But outside of that, uh, since we on the topic of immigrant, I mean, yeah, man. <laughs> no disrespect, but I'm tired of seeing these these little commercials. Y'all, they giving out the they giving out the money to the immigrants, y'all. Ten thousand dollars, y'all. You better go get it. I know y'all heard them little ghetto commercials before. I thought it was like a joke or something, but nah, they really pumping money into uh, the immigrants that's here in America right now. They allowing them to come over, putting them in hotels, don't have to pay for room and board. They get money every month just for existing. Get more food stamps than Americans that got kids. It's crazy, fam. It's like they're getting more assistance than the actual American people. Every corner I go to, every time I'm driving somewhere, I, I see some like some homeless people just sit, sitting around. Homeless veterans. Why that money can't go to the vet? Why you can't put them in the hotel? Like it's just a lot of stuff I'm noticing. And illegal immigration seems to be a big problem. Now key word, illegal immigration. If they go through the correct process to get over here, sure, do your thing. But in my opinion, that money could go to much better use. I see Americans struggling every day. Man, I remember last year, I seen a homeless person uh, outside laying in the snow. Well, it's cold as hell outside. But they out here pushing uh, a lot of that money into the immigrants. I, I don't know why. I just feel like it go to better uses. That's just my opinion. But in conclusion, that lady for sure was eating the cat. Donald Trump did not lie. The person we should be mad at is the news stations and people like that, right? Why is this not big news in the media? Why is a lady walking around Ohio eating cats and spiders and no one knows about it? We got a whole Resident Evil zombie out there and we over here talking about pop the balloon. Bring out the next lovely lady. Nah, that show be funny as hell, I can't even lie. But nah, it's a lot of stuff out there we need to pay more attention to. There's no reason why these people on the Pop the Balloon show should be going viral. But an immigrant eating cats and spiders, that's not going viral. But anyway, man, how y'all feel about this? Let me know in the comment section, bro. Like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell, man. Hey, man, follow me on Instagram, TZFBaby252. Over there eating a cat. Unhand that cat. Put that cat down. Take that cat out your mouth. Home gone. Prolific. Bitch, I'm in these streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in these streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in these streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in these streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in these streets. Fuck this in the street.